this whole uh, vlog idea planned out and I literally started to film and edit the whole thing. And then I forgot to film and honestly, I have been in just such a rut and like such a bad mind space that I just haven't even really wanted to vlog. Instead of a weekly vlog, because that was the OG plan, I'm instead going to do a little reset day and I thought maybe I would just film that instead um, and just kind of show you guys what I'm going to attempt to do to feel better. Things that I like to do when I have anxiety, a little tip, a little anxiety front to front tip. Something that I like to do, I have my regular planner, which I write like everything that I have to do every single day, right? But then when I'm feeling really anxious and I'm like, dang, I feel like I've been really unproductive, or I'm feeling down even, depressed, what have you, I like to take just a scratch piece of paper, or you can do it in your journal, I guess. I just always like, my OCD makes me not want to put it anywhere else because I like to throw it away after because it doesn't fit with the rest of my organization style. But you can do whatever you want and um, make a extremely too specific to-do list so that I get to cross more things off. And I feel that validation and that sense of accomplishment. And so I remember to actually do these things because when I'm doing a reset day, um, I or even just like self-care day or whatever, I feel like I tend to just be like, oh, now I'll just like sit and watch TV. But, to, you know, a reset day, resetting your mind, resetting your body, it actually does take um, work. It, it does take, like getting out of a rut, a depressive rut, a uh, mental health rut, it's, it takes work. And so you kind of have to actually do things that make you feel better or that you know will make you feel better. Um, that's where the to-do list comes on. I like to write very very specific things brush your teeth brush your hair skincare shower eat breakfast eat lunch eat dinner like i it's very specific someone who does not struggle with mental health issues at all would be like you really need to write that down on your to-do list like that just would come naturally like you don't need a reminder that's not how a lot of people's brain works. Taking a shower, brushing your teeth, brushing your hair, things like that, that does take work. That takes a lot of energy and a lot of effort and it deserves an X off the to-do list. So it's a nice little reminder to myself that these are little accomplishments considering what I'm going through in my head. But on the day-to-day, -day, I don't give myself enough credit for just pushing through, you know what I mean? So yeah, this isn't necessarily like a getting my groove back, like having fun, doing like fun hobbies and stuff. This is more like just a realistic how I try to get myself out of like a depressive or anxious rut video. So if you came here for like crazy adventures and stuff, I'm writing shower on the to-do list, baby. It's not like I put all this pressure on this one day. I just like to remind myself things that make me feel accomplished and to, um, maybe start like in a new direction and finally maybe get some good sleep or be like oh i had a good day um yeah things like that so it's really just it's not like a one day fix all <laughs> obviously <laughs> i would have not been depressed a long time ago but it's more a like getting out of a rut reminding myself that there are things i could and probably should be doing to make myself feel better on my daily okay so i finished writing down my very extensive list and then crossing off the things that i already did um, so I wrote down, get out of bed, uh, brush teeth and hair, skincare day, uh, get ready, journal, check my emails, finish my captions for my last video. I've been trying to, um, put closed captions on all my content just to be more accessible. Pick up apartment, work out, eat enough today. And then below that, I put three little circles and said three healthy meals at least. Um, I never eat enough. Pick a room and declutter slash deep clean. I've been like really wanting to declutter and deep clean our apartment and I just haven't really. Um, so ever since I did my closet declutter, I've just been like really wanting to do that everywhere because it felt so good. 
um but i just haven't because i feel like the other places in our house are really overwhelming <laughs> shower tan putting my hair oil in because i didn't last night after i washed it my skincare night routine um i wanted to put my nail strengthener on nail strengthener on take my vitamins at some point before i shower obviously i have put my aha mask on because i haven't done that in a hot minute and i can feel it and then yoga at some point read my audiobook um take my vitamins did i already say that um i've been posting on instagram all the books that i've been reading throughout the year so i need to post the third book that i read this year because i haven't done that yet and then i put reply to mom because i know i have a text from my mom but i'm the type of person where like i will literally forget my memory lately has been terrible um so i will literally see that like a text pop up and i will not just like oh forget to reply like whatever i will actually forget it exists so i need to put that down because my memory lately has been like so weird um and that's everything so yeah it's very extensive but they're all things that i think will kind of reset my mind my spirit and my body my tea is kind of kicking in so i'm feeling kind of productive so i think i'm actually going to start with the stuff that i don't necessarily want to do which would be like my captions and my um emails and stuff so i think i'm gonna do that first and then i will check in it's really boring so i'm honestly probably not going to show you guys i literally just have to watch myself over and over and over and over again <laughs> Options. I ate lunch, I took my vitamins, I listened to my audiobook and picked up the house, which you guys saw. Girk called me on his lunch, so I talked to him for a while. I was texting my mom. Um, yeah, I did a lot, and now I'm going to work out because I feel like I've been sitting for a while, and I kind of just want to like do something, like some sort of energy release. <laughs> 